Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Let's 100% Far Cry New Dawn. We are back here again in Prosperity, and we are going to go ahead and talk to this guy here. We may have to upgrade Prosperity first. If we do, if we do, we're going to have to take on more outposts first. Um, but I'm going to try. It's not yellow, so I'm thinking we may have to upgrade it first. Glad you're back, Captain. You got Joseph C. down our side. That's right. I hope it didn't come at too high a price. There's something different about you. You've changed. Yeah? But now the New Eden's attacking the highwaymen. The twins are fighting a war on two fronts. We need to take advantage of this. We've done good work in prosperity, but it's still not enough. We need to invest more ethanol into our facilities. Right. That's the key to getting prosperity back up and running again. I agree. Once this place is at its peak, we'll be in a good spot to really take the fight to Mickey and Lou. While you're out doing that, I'm going to do some recon. See if we can't get a foothold deeper in their territory. I'll meet you back here once you're done. Well, there you go. So, yeah, we've got to go... Thanks to you, Wikibinia is growing faster than a goat. We've got to upgrade facilities. We only got to upgrade one. How much, uh... How much do we have? Oh, we, well, we need a lot for that one. We don't have that much, it looks like. Um, yeah, we're only on level two there. What about this place? Hey, we hey buddy. Were. We could do that one, actually. Uh, should we do another... Another... Oh, another one of these real fast? I think we fuckers. should before we do that. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay, yeah. Back to okay, whatever you say, one buddy. Thing about the highway men. Once they're exposed, they always come back stronger. Right. Seen it. Okay. So, if you ever want to rob a stronghold again... We can, but they'll do everything in their power to make it harder for us. Okay, I know that. Or, there's a new stronghold we can go to. Check, sir. Highwaymen are controlling the only bridge that's still standing over the canyons to the southwest. Let's do it. for people to cross the bridge and then BAM! They do an ambush and take all the stuff. In French, we call that so far fourré. A real greaseball shit. So you want to know the plan? <laughs> There's no fucking plan, okay? We take from them like they take from the others, and that's it. Merci, bonsoir, Rusty. So you tell me, we go back to the warship, or you and me, la grosse patate, we go to Navajo Bridge? Laquelle tu veux? Hi there. Okay, well, whatever. Let's go somewhere, though. Um. Oh. Alright. Sure, let's do it. No, oh, what? Yeah, let's go to... I want to go there. Sure. Go. Does this place take us to... Like, places we've already been? I don't think so. Navajo Bridge. Oh, this is like... Wait a minute. This is nowhere near... What? Navajo Bridge would be in the southwest somewhere. Why would we be going here? Why would the highwaymen be way down here? Alright, whatever. I guess that's one thing about here. It takes you to other locations besides just in Montana. Um. Find the supplies and I'll radio you the extraction point. All right. And don't forget to gear up. Good luck. Be careful. The package has a GPS tracker. Where it goes, the highwaymen follow. Yeah. All right. Do we have? Can we? Can we bring our our people here? Um. Character, inventory, perks. I don't think we can. Apparently not. We do have 35 available points. Holy crap. Let's just go ahead and grab all the rest of these that we hadn't got yet. We might as well. Or at least most of them. We only lacking one. Uh, why can't we get that one? we got to be level three. Yeah, we got two available now. So, And we got these down here now, too. Leap of Faith. Uh, press space while in midair for additional jump height. Oh, awesome. Old C to temporarily become much harder to detect by humans. That's cool. Uh, Wrath. Yeah, okay, all right, cool. Well, we got some different things down there, but we're not going to worry about that right now. Let's grab our bow. Let's uh, go investigate this place real fast, see what we got going on here. Um, nothing. Anything in here? Yeah, we got a toolbox and a note. And these notes I want to read because this is somewhere new. 
So, uh, abandoned area. We've uncovered some trailers on the other side of the bridge, so that'll be our new living quarters. They're not in the best condition, but unless you prefer the freezing cold or sweltering heat of these shacks, it's as good as gonna get. Consider this area abandoned. Okay, so this is probably where they originally were, maybe. The highwaymen, that is, and they moved over this way. What is with the pink smoke? We've got a... Got a little town over there, which is also kind of cool. Okay, there's one traveling around there. We want to try our best not to disturb these people. We've got to be stealthy here. All right, let's see if we can... Whoop, nope, don't do that. Jeez. Can we kill this guy? Attack him? Gee. Can you kill him for me? Yes, you can. Oh, we got a snake somewhere in here, too. I hear it. Um, what about some of these guys? Can you kill him? Yeah, he's dead now. Very good. Very good, sir. I like it a lot. I want to be as stealthy as we possibly can. And uh, we're going to head over to these builds. I don't know if they have alarms. I don't see any. I'm going to let him kill as many people as he can. Because he actually ranks up when he does that. So if we see anyone, I'll probably let him try to kill him for us. Nothing in the school bus. We're going to go up into this building first. Let's just be real. I oh, hear somebody. Okay, there's somebody in there. Kill him. You go kill him. I'm going to look around here. Was he going to kill him or not? Maybe he's trying to find a spot, a way to do it. We got a toolbox there. Take that. Nothing over there. Just kind of looking around. There's a note. Orders. Move the furniture from this building into the next one. Leave the kitchen stuff. We'll store produce here and use this space for breaks and bills. Wow. Look at that. That is a deep canyon. So we must be at the Grand Canyon then. Or, well, probably not the Grand Canyon, but it's a Grand Canyon. All right, let's see if we can get in this place. Since he's not really doing his job, we'll just go into the front door. Another note. We're going to use this old office as a watchtower. Anyone comes down the eastern road, it's our job to send the alert. And once we're all in position, we'll wait for the sorry saps to cross into the bridge and spring the trap. Easy. There it is again. I hear something again. You do. Okay, he's actually... Oh, look at that. He's got a freaking RPG. Okay, he's coming down the steps. You're dead. And I will eat you. I don't want your RPG, though. So far, so good. Nobody knows we're here. Except for the dead guys, and they're dead, so it doesn't matter. Okay, we got a lookout point here that we can kind of see everything, so let's kind of look around and pick off as many people as we can from here, if we can. Um, do we see any bad guys? I don't even see any bad guys down there at all. We haven't been over there yet either. Alright, let's, uh, let's go down here, I guess. Okay, somebody started to see us there, but... I right. Okay, there's somebody up there. You, kill this guy. Can you kill him? You missed. You got him. Good job. Oh. Kill him. Nice. You are the man. I like you. You're a good guy. You do great work. And this guy, that's, and that's weird, like, he's, instead of the father trying to help him be a better person, he's actually, like, worships evil, they said, which I find interesting. 
Let's go, uh, let's look around here. We don't know where this thing's gonna be at, but I feel it's gonna be in one of these bigger buildings. I hear somebody making some noise. So we got a note right there. Oh, there's somebody right there. We'll kill him ourselves. Got both of them guys. So that's what this note says. This is the only bridge that connects these canyons for miles. You want to cross, you got to pay up. Nothing free in this world. Not so long as we're still around and all these drifters are going to understand that. Okay. Yeah, well, I'm actually taking you guys out pretty quick. So, oh, we got a bad guy over there somewhere. Uh, I want to, I want the brick buildings on either side of the bridge reinforced. We don't know what kind of people will be having, will be coming through here. So we need to be prepared for the worst. Line the rooftops with sandbags and take half-day shifts watching the roads to the east and the west. So where's this guy at? We had somebody that was kind of looking at us. From over there. I bet you that this location of this thing changes occasionally as well. So you can probably replay these over and it's in a different spot each time. It's kind of interesting. It makes it, it makes it fun. Oh, up there. Okay, you're dead. How in the world you didn't see them other two guys die is beyond me. Oh, we're inside the search zone. Oh. That was actually pretty close. When we grab this thing, we're going to have to go quickly. There's another note there. This building's taken the least beating, and it's far its far enough from the main road that it's out of harm's way. Store any valuables you find in here. Where is it? It must be upstairs. Let's go ahead and switch to uh, a better gun, just in case. There it is. Let's grab that. Alright, so we're going to take it, and then we'll have to figure out where to go. Let's go. Okay, now listen up. Okay. The bus station southwest of you. That's where I'll get you. Alright. Okay, southwest. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, we're pretty slow here. Hopefully we won't run into... Everyone go check on the package. The package is not there. Now they know where we're at. Oh man, they are. The highwaymen are going to keep sending reinforcements. Yeah, I, I realize that. Here, so oh, look what I found. I found something good. We gotta get to the top. They are gonna be coming up here, though. That's the thing. So. Oh yeah, here we go. Where? Where? There's the judge. Blow it up. Come on, blow it up. Nice. Where's anyone else? Here comes one. Gun's gonna be overheating pretty quick here. Okay, you got them guys. Anybody else? Anybody else? There's somebody up here somewhere. There he is. Pretty easy. Dang. Alright, where is the chopper? I don't see it. I don't see it. Oh, that's. He's talking about my chopper, of course. Uh, did I get them all? Oh, here's one. I think I got them all. So he's landing, getting ready to. Heads up, I'm coming in. Time to get the fuck out of here, I think. Agreed, agreed. Where's this other guy at? Okay, he's coming around the corner here. Alright, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Get off the gun. Let's go.
He's still he's still here. He's still here. Come on, we gotta go, we gotta go. Let's go, let's go. Get in. Yeah, just leave. Let's leave that guy here. He'll be fine. Look at this guy. What's this guy doing? Okay, let's do that again. I don't know if I would fly over the bridge. That's probably not the uh, best idea, but hey, we made it. That's all that matters, right? So we got some ethanol on that. We should be able to upgrade the rest of the base now. At least a little bit. I think we got some ethanol off that. Hopefully. Now we got a lot of uh, a lot of loot. Titanium 300. Wow. 100 duct tape. No ethanol. All right. Well, we know we can do this. Hey. You see what I mean? Come here. No, not right now. Let's upgrade this real fast. Because we can't upgrade this. And I believe this might put the base. I don't know if it'll put the base at level 3 or not. It might. I think it actually puts it all the way up to level 2, maybe. Well, we got that going for us. So we can do the main mission now, I think. Wait and see what it says. What does it say? Okay, this time, this time. Uh-huh. I was in the middle of a freaking shootout. I don't know, man. I got caught between some losers and some people they were trying to kill as I was wrapping up this person's leg gouge. I just checked the F out. Woke up with a bunch of jerky wrapped in a thank you note in the middle of a forest that I knew for damn sure I didn't use that didn't used to be there. So like, can we draw a hypothesis or two from this crap? Right, A, I can still do the meds magic when I'm checked the F out, and two, no one gives a crap. I didn't finish my medical degree. Medical degree. Ha, huh. dope. Uh, yeah, that's that's the crazy, weird, weird chick, obviously. Got another one right here. These just pop up everywhere. Grace's reflection. Despite everything, life was going fine. I was able to keep a watch over Rye family while they got people together to build prosperity. There was the odd troublemaker, but nothing I couldn't handle. Then my eyes started going bad. By the time the highwaymen came in, I'd lost a step. Couldn't rely on one shot and kill anymore. I was getting into dogfights, barely getting away unscathed. I had to improvise, gather materials, build better weapons. That's the key to survival out here. When the going gets tough, the tough makes better the tough makes better guns. So I guess these are just notes, uh Upgrade prosperity to level three, which I don't think we can do quite yet, but we'll try. Oh, actually, we can. Interesting. So all the facilities have been upgraded to level two already. Okay, well, let's do it. I really feel like though we need to. We need to get out there and start doing some more of the bases before we go too much further into the main story. Yeah, I know we are. I know we are. Homecoming is one difficulty. And uh, we'll do that next, but um We're gonna go we're gonna go real quick and we're gonna go to a do a couple more of these little little side mission things like this, Roughnecks Craig, before the end of this episode. And then then we're going to start on a on a quest to go around and get some more of these, basically these outposts. we got to get some of these things up to level 2, a lot of them actually up to level 2. Uh, and then once we get the guns to level 3, we can start worrying about getting those up to level 3 as well. So let's go ahead and go over here to uh, Roughnecks Crag. I don't know if we can actually travel there. No, we can't. We can travel. We travel to Davenport's Plains. Let's do that. We've got a handful here we can get to real fast. We only have about eight more minutes before the end of the episode, so we'll grab one of them, and then we'll start the next episode and try to get a couple more around there before we go maybe to another base. So here we are at, what did I say it was? Roughnecks, Roughnecks Crag or something like that? Davenport's Plains. Uh, let's get our bow out just in case there's people around here. We fast travel right right to this place so we may not have anybody around here actually uh, should be duct tape here as well I believe ok 
can't remember what this place was. There's two of them right off the bat. Duct tape. I can't believe I forgot duct tape. No stash in world is complete without duct tape. I gotta find all the rolls I can and and chuck them in the barn with my other stuff. I'm gonna make the strictest, the stickiest man in the county. I'm gonna be the stickiest man in the county. Oh, all right, that's kind of weird. So maybe they're in the barn. Kind of gives us a little hint. How do we get up here to the barn, though? Looks like we're gonna have to climb up there and rappel down. Whoop, that didn't work out. All right, let's try that again. All right, so we got big yellow trunk, duct tape. Toolbox, safe. Looking for one, one more roll of duct tape. It's gotta be in the barn, you would think. Although it may not be. There we go, get that. It's not. Great. It's not in the barn. Terrific. Uh, where else would it be? There it is. One more roll of duct tape, and we're done with that. And another toolbox. I still don't really see the uh, the reason to grab this much stuff. I mean, it's it's like it's so easy. So easy to find loot. Way easier than I feel like it should be. Let's go to Filthgate. Filthgate's not that far away. 200 meters. We can get there pretty quickly. And uh, hopefully there'll be a, at least a little bit of resistance for us here. We've got the itching to shoot someone in the head. I have to figure out how to get across the creek here. Guess we'll just run across it. And right up the other side. If we can make it up the other side. Uh, don't know if we can get up here or not. Hmm. Maybe we can go around this way. Lord, lady. You're way out of shape. You sound like me. Alright, what do we got here? Okay, we do have some bad guys here. Oh, actually quite a few bad guys here. Um, one thing we can do with those, dynamite. Oh, freaking pig. Uh, the only thing I can think to do is maybe... Ah, right, I got them guys. This guy hasn't seen us yet. Come on, stick your head out here. There you go. And you? There's one. Oh, you. Come on. Okay, I thought I was hoping that'd blow up, but it didn't. Okay, got you. One more. Oh. Missed you. Oh, his abilities changed. I don't know what we can do with him now, but we're going to check that out. There we go. Got you right in the arm. I think that was it. See what uh, what abilities he has now. What different does he have? Um, while the judge is with you, animals will not attack unless they are attacked first. Oh, that's nice. I like that ability. Shoot, something's on fire. All right, we got duct tape again. There's one roll. We got three rolls total. Let's grab loot him. Go ahead and loot this guy up here while the place burns to the ground. And right, we'll let that burn for a minute. We'll go up top. Yellow crate. No duct tape up top. Oh, we got that. It's up in the air, so let's go ahead and grab that. Where'd it go? There it is. Duct tape there. Grab that pack pack. Uh, we got... Let's see. We got one more. Here's a note. Survival journal. These highwaymen just don't stop. They're spreading all over the valley and looting everything in sight. I've been running from them for weeks. I've slept in every abandoned wreck. If things don't ease up, I'm going to die of a heart attack. I have to get out of this valley. One more thing of duct tape somewhere. Okay, that's right. They don't attack me now. Which is, which is actually really nice. A yucca plant. 
Oh, where could it be? I mean, there's not really anything over around here. It looks like... There it is. Very good. Okay, guys, that's going to end it, I think, for me in this episode. I'm going to quickly look, make sure there's nothing close, close by, and there's not. I mean, this is down here. Oh, uh, why not? Let's go ahead and do this real fast. It's not that far away. Maybe we can fly most of the way there. I feel like we still have, like, five minutes left, which should be enough time to get this one done. Uh, well, we can't fly from here. We can fly from this next ridge. Maybe, I don't know. We might hit a tree and die. We're going to give it a shot. Oh, that didn't work. There we go. Try not to hit anything. Yeah, we're good. We're good. We can get most of the way there. Just pull this parachute out right here before we hit the ground so we don't die. And uh, we're right up there and see if we can find everything real fast. And we are searching for struts now, I believe. What are those? Why are those popping up? Are those supposed to be animals, maybe? Huh. Oh, this is a... This is a good place. I'm not sure why we have a... I'm not sure why we can see people now. It must be a perk of his or something. So here we go. We got a note here. Back in the day when we were fighting Peggy's, 8-bit pizza became a hangout for those of us who needed a break. Even in our darkest moments, we never forgot to laugh, and sometimes that was enough to keep us fighting. Figured we could use a place like that again. I wish my friend Mary May was alive to see this. 8-bit pizza. That's right, that's right. We could play games and stuff, couldn't we? I remember. Like on arcade machines. Look at you, girl. You go, okay? You go, girl, okay? You go, you're so brave. Doing doing a great job. You know, I ran away from home once, too, but I was so scared. I was just crying the whole time. Yeah. Oh, my dad. Look at you. So brave. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, she said, how old are you? I'm about 30, 32, I think. Not really sure. Something like that. Hey, we got them all. Nice. We'll go up top real quick, but I think that's about it. I think that's about all we got here in this place. Dang, boy, they are having a good time. Holy cow. Yeah, that's about it. All right, guys, that's going to do it for me. You guys have a great day. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, consider leaving a like, subscribing to the channel, and telling your friends about me. I appreciate it. I hope you have uh, a good a good day. It's not the weekend yet, I don't think. So when weekend gets here, you have a good weekend, too. But have a good day until then. So I will see you next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye.